comfort zone in this game at any time. Uh, we just, uh, our defense was good. That kind of kept us in there. But I didn't know if we could survive when Elijah and Joe both had bad games, but we did. Uh, Marek was huge. Buddy had a really good first half. Second half, we really couldn't get him a shot over there. They just started face guarding him, but that makes the lanes open. And Elijah finally got in there and got to the basket and hit Marek, and Quincy got a couple. Uh, our defense was good. We really did a good job guarding the three-point line. Uh, Pittsburgh's a good team. They're physical. They're tough. Uh, uh, there is no such thing as an easy game. Every game's like this. Every night we go out to play. So um, I thought the big key was uh, Elijah's drive, and then when he, he got it all the way there and missed, Marek was right there because his man was helping, and he got it and put it back in. But uh, big plays, big plays. But uh, you know, it hurts us when Barama goes out. It hurts our inside defense. He was good tonight defensively, and when he gets goes out, it, it does hurt us in there. But. You know, they're a good team, good defensive team, and it's not easy to score. We're fortunate that, you know, Buddy got it going early to get us the lead. Uh, that was uh, enabled us to kind of hang in there at the end. But uh, it's a good win, and, uh, you know, we got another tough game in just a couple of days. So we'll see. Questions? Quincy tonight. Yeah, he got, you know, when he's in there and we're driving, his man's helping. So he's going to get some opportunities there. And, uh, you know, he's been good there. He, he's got a rebound better on the defensive end. Uh, he can't take the ball out of bounds. He's not supposed to. And he gets down there, didn't know where to go with it. But uh, we're fortunate that Marek's really good there. He waited and waited on Elijah, and then he, we got the long pass. So that's what we were looking for there. But again, uh, this was a tough one. We did a lot of good things. Uh, and with Joe and uh, Elijah not being on their game, I don't think either one of them made a three, probably. Well, maybe one. Joe made that one. That was a big shot, too. He hadn't made anything, and then he sticks that one. So that was good. But you know, we survived the, those two guys having a bad game, which is, which is good. Good thing for this team. Where Howard still hurt, I don't know when he'll be back. Considering how much the team has seemingly improved over the past month or so, I don't so. think so. All right, well, is this a game that your team would have been able to win a month or so? Yeah, ago? yeah, we could have won this. We could have won this. We, you know, our defense was better tonight, but Pittsburgh's not a great three-point shooting team. So that along the way, you're going to play a mixture of teams, and you're going to play some teams that shoot it really good, like Notre Dame, and we're going to play some teams that don't shoot it so good. So it's a little bit of advantage. I thought our rebounding was good tonight, offensive rebound especially. But when we get those isolations and Elijah drives, they have to help. And that gives us a really good opportunity to get an offensive rebound in that situation. Marek's really good. Marek was really, really good tonight. He's a really key player for us to be successful. Coach, even though you've won five, your team has won five in a row, you don't think they've improved? We're getting just a little better, not, not enough, not enough. How many guys have you coached over the years that can do as many things as Marek's been able to do this year and all these years? You know, he's good at the four. It's good to have a versatile guy there. We've had a few guys that can do some of those things, but he's he's really versatile player, uh, plays center, plays, you know, plays forward. He handles the ball, takes it out. He's, he's a huge key to what we do. Did Xavier Johnson slower release show up on film? Pardon? Did Xavier Johnson's slower release from the outside show up on film? Well, he's he's got a good, he got shots off. He just didn't make them tonight. When you look at the defensive side of things, what has changed on the interior for you guys? Is it just being more active? You know, they're they're not. You know, early in the year we played bigger, stronger guys. We'd still have trouble with those guys. Jim, where along the lines did you realize Buddy was going to be so effective? Kind of. Well, the you know, he's gotten better with the ball. He works hard. He works hard. He's not just a shooter. He's worked hard on getting in the lane and making plays. And, uh, you know, I think he's he, he works so hard. He, he's got another level even to go up. He's ahead of schedule because he works for, out four hours a day. He works out every day. Sunday he comes in and does yoga, and then he shoots or lifts, and then, you know, he just does that. Days off, he does that. You know, he's, that's why he's gotten better. He just he works hard at the game, and uh, yeah, he's he's getting better. Got to work on his free throw shooting. 
Jimmy, you talked about Marek and the many things he can do for you, but how important is it for you to have him scoring when he's been scoring the last few games? It's all important. We need him to score, especially if Joe's off. If Joe's has a good game today and Elijah has a good shooting game, then it wouldn't matter as much. But when those two guys are off, then we need him to score. When Barama goes out with his fourth foul, you have to go with Quincy for a long stretch. Right. Um, what was he able to give you in there? Not enough. He's got to do more. You know, he's a good player. He's got to get more. He's got to do better. He's trying to learn the game, figure out where he can go and not. You know, he, he'll get a couple big rebounds, make a couple really great plays, and then he's you know misses something on defense. Or that last rebound, you know, Johnson misses it and gets a rebound right over him. You know, he's six foot two. We got to, he's got to get, we got to get that rebound. You know, he's learning. There's, again, he didn't play. He hasn't played organized ball really in a long time, and he's learning the game. What he does well, he. He does well. I'm just glad he made the two free throws at Notre Dame. That might have been our miracle for the year. So we'll see. I think he's going to make a three someday, but I'm not sure if it's going to be in my lifetime, but he's going to make one someday. All right, got to go to a game. We'll see you.